The pH value is important to know for a whole range of technological and laboratory processes, environmental monitoring, human health control and in other fields. So what is the pH? All of us remember back from our school years that water solutions of any acids have one thing in common. They contain hydrogen cations, which define the acid properties of solutions. The alkaline properties of solutions are defined by the other particles, hydroxide anions. In neutral solutions, like distilled water, concentration values for these two types of particles are equal. The acidity and alkalinity of the solutions can be described by the molar concentration of hydrogen cations. In neutral solutions, this value constitutes 10 minus 7 mole per liter. In acid solutions, over 10 minus 7 mole per liter. And in alkaline solutions, less than 10 minus 7 mole per liter. To avoid the inconvenience of using negative exponents, scientists developed a new indicator, a pH value, which is in essence the decimal logarithm of hydrogen cations, concentration with the opposite sign. Now it's really easy to remember. pH in neutral solutions is equal to 7. In acid solutions, less than 7. And in alkaline solutions, it's over 7. To determine the pH of a solution, we use various acid-based indicators or their mixtures called universal indicators. These substances change their color depending on the pH. Today, there exist several hundreds of acid-based indicators. They have been synth synthesized starting from the middle of 19th century. Some of them, like litmus and phenolphthalein, we already did get to know during school chemistry classes. The table shows how the color of indicators changes depending on the pH value. However, the indicator-based method for determining the pH value is rather approximate. It cannot be used if solutions are cloudy or colored. Besides, specialists know that this method entails indicative, salt and temperature errors. The pH value of a solution can be accurately measured by, with the help of a pH meter. It is, in fact, a kind of potentiometer. pH metering is based on measuring the EMF or galvanic cell consisting of a glass electrode with a potential depending on the pH. In any comparison electrode, both of them placed into the solution being tested. The EMF of the system is registered with the help of a multi meter. Since the EMF depends on the pH of the solution, the device scale should be graded in pH units. This is the most accurate and universal method for pH measurements that is well suited for cloudy and colored solutions.